Hey there everybody, Ira here with a little quick forward. Uh, while I was recording this video, I had some pretty nasty performance issues as you will see in the video. There's a lot of uh, frame lag, there's a lot of input lag. Uh, a lot of times the game just seems to run in slow motion and I couldn't figure out why that was. Um, I still don't know exactly what was causing that. Uh, but I do want to make a note up front here that I went back and tried the game again without recording via OBS and the game didn't seem to have too much trouble with the lag. So uh, I, I just still don't really know why that happened. I've never had that happen with a game that it slows to a crawl while I'm recording, especially a, a visually relatively simple game like this one. Uh, but I just want to let everybody know that, give it a fair shake. Um, as long as you have a decent system, I do think this game should run fine. Uh, so please forgive the lagginess in the video. Enjoy! Hey there everybody, this is Ira, and I'm back with another new little indie game that you might not have heard of. This one is called Grim Earth. It is in early access, it is not finished. So this is kind of a, an early version of the game, but you can get it on Steam right now for a few dollars slash euros slash whatever currency you're using. Uh, this is by a developer who uh, also created the game Citadel 1986, which I have not played, so I have no real point of comparison. Uh, I am playing with a gamepad, and as you can see, the left stick does move things around as a mouse. We'll see how well the gamepad works. Uh, the Steam page says it has partial gamepad support, so we'll see about that. We're going to go into configuration. We always want to check the options before we play this game. Audio, we've got music and sound effects uh, separate, which is good. Video, we can change the brightness, HUD transparency, and the HUD scale. Okay, that's excellent. That's a lot more than I expect from an indie game. Uh, gamepad, I'm using the gamepad already, and we don't need to define the keys. So, I have not played this yet. This is a blind uh, first look at the game. All I know about it is that it seems very cute. Bit of a platformer, and that it's set on Earth 5,000 years in the future. So, um, let's get into it. Let's, let's start. So here we go, we have a warning, early access. Please ignore everything that is broken and recommend the game to your friends. That's adorable and I like it. Uh, play. Let's see what we're getting into here. So I think that's me. I'm a little spacesuit because the, the earth, uh, the uh, air on earth apparently is not very good anymore. Not really sure what I'm in there. Is that like an escape pod? <laughs> oh dear. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Where am I? Having to press the A button to scroll the uh, text forward, by the way, which is good. Jump out to continue. Okay, well, it doesn't say what button jump is. I did figure out that it's the A button in the gamepad because that's what it usually is. Could use a little bit more um, explanation. I'm curious if you stay in here longer, does something come up? But seems not. Again, it's early access. Maybe they'll, they'll add something else. Hey, you're awake! Is that is that a smartwatch? <laughs> cool, a talking watch. Oh god, I don't have amnesia, am I? I'm not a watch, I'm a hub. I'm a hub. Sorry, not a hub. Well, you look like a watch to me. No, I'm hub. Okay. Okay, fine. Hello, hub. Give me a moment to calibrate. I wish I could calibrate. Do I oh, please tell me I don't have amnesia. It's such an overused trope. What is this place? Very good question. Is HUD, HUD is hub? Hub. Exit to the right. Got it. I win! <laughs> My memories. Oh no, I have amnesia. They're gone. Um, alright. I'm gonna forgive that, that ridiculous trope. Because, um, this looks fun so far. And it's a simple and easy framing device. I understand why people use it. It's just, uh, ooh. Getting framey. Getting a little framey. Big shells are more bouncy. Hoo hoo hoo! They sure are. And up I go. Spikes hurt. Well, I could have guessed that, but I appreciate being told nonetheless. Ooh, the gravity is real low. Look how high I can jump. Either that or I have some kind of a jump boost. Okay. So far, so simple. Hold jump to jump higher. Okay, well, I was already doing that kind of uh, out of instinct, but again, good to know. So if I just tap it versus if I hold it. Oh, yeah. Things with, things with eyes chase you. We'll stop it. Please don't chase me. Whee! Oh, it gets real framey, folks. Now, to be fair, I am uh, recording in full HD as I'm playing. A sign. <laughs> it looks like you falling off a cliff. I really don't want that to happen. Just remember to hold your jump button down. Okay. My what? <laughs> Fourth wall breakage there. 
Um, okay, so yeah, uh, in some of these moments, it's it's getting it's getting real framey now. As I said, I am recording at 1080p, and that does slow down the graphics processing a little bit because my graphics card is trying to do two things at once. Uh, however, I would not have expected that kind of visual lag in a little game like this. So that's uh, surprising. Again, it's clearly a uh, oh my goodness. It's clearly an early build. Maybe there's still some optimization to be done. We are going to give everything the benefit of a doubt. <laughs> Grab Vine's walking socks. Well, I love the charm of the, uh... Whee! The charm of the, the kind of the text and the, the narrator's voice and stuff is, is nice. Um, hmm, a door. Oh, it's not open. Gotta get this door open, I bet. Hey, you should help me out. No way, sure thing. Why not? I'm a helpful kind of person. Great, I need you to find me. Done. You're on my wrist. For the last time, I'm not a watch. I know. I know you're a hub. So where are you? I have absolutely no idea. <laughs> Spectacular. That's not a lot to go on. Find hubs somewhere, maybe. Okay. Hmm, a panel. Okay. Looks like it's missing something. I guess I gotta find something for this panel. Huh? What do we got here? Collect power cells. How do I do that? There we go. B button, apparently. Playing in the gamepad. Ooh, yeah, man. I, I am not sure how much this is going to come through in the video, because sometimes if I'm playing and I get frame lag, um, that door's locked. Right. So this probably needs two cells to open this one, so I'm going to have to go back. These wires lead to that panel. I should maybe get that working. Well... I don't think I can get it working. Because I think... I think I need to have two. Right? Alright, let's let's try. Can I put it back? Oh, goodness me. <laughs> uh, is it still closed? Yeah, it's still closed. Okay. So I'm going to grab that. One thing with the graphical style, the graphics are really nice, but sometimes those little spikies kind of blend into the background. You gotta really be vigilant. Alright, so if this one works. Use the power cell. Got it. Down we go. Can I open the door now, please? Yay! Now, what are you? Oh, you're just a light in the background, I guess. I thought maybe I'd be able to bounce on this. Yeah, uh, like I said, the, the graphical style, it looks really cool. Um, but there is the issue that because the background and the foreground don't have much differentiating them, it can be a little bit tricky to figure out, uh, what's what. I'm sure, I'm sure I'll get used to it as I go. Climb up, grab the vines. Okay, just jump into them. That works. I come through here. See, again, like I thought maybe this was an obstacle, but it's just, uh, it's just decoration. Grab the vines, then jump across. Got it. Why did I have to grab the vines first? Well, would I have hit my head if I had tried to jump from where I was? Maybe that's it. Woo! -hoo! That was a close call. All right, up we go. Oh, hello, hello, friend. I'm just gonna, just gonna hang out down here. You go right back up there. Thank you very much. Great. And on we go. I guess I'm going the right way. Certainly hope so. All right, what's over here? Is that a robot? Are you an enemy? You look friendly. Hey, can you help me? Yay. Sure, what's up? It's my cave. It's been overrun by slugs. They're not very friendly. Well, slugs rarely are. What can I do about it? Well, I have some ray guns. But I can't use them. Oh, why not? Ah, uh, you don't like violence in video games. No, not at all. I have no hands. <laughs> okay, I'll help you. I'll help you. Help everyone. Thank you. You are good. Well, yes, I am. Thank you for noticing. Come back when you've squished them. I might just have a reward for you. Ooh, you might, huh? You might have a reward for me. Collect ray guns and health packs. Got them. Um, can I, like, go in here? Oh, it's locked. Okay. So it looks like B button is action. Okay. Uh, is there a limit to- oh, there is a limit. Up 
in the top right there. It says 80. Oh, it's getting laggy again. Oh, goodness me. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, that's something they're really gonna have to fix, I think. Uh, before they go full release on this game. You, you gotta you gotta deal with the, the lag there. Oh my goodness. So these are slugs, huh? Now what are these little gems? Okay. I'm looking, I, I don't see anything going, oh I think maybe that's just your score. The score is going up. Whoa! Hello! Uh. Oh goodness, yeah, even the controls are getting a little bit laggy now. So, I don't know if they just require you to have a, a higher quality video card than I have. I mean, the one I have is, is certainly not top of the line, but oh my gosh, it is so slow. So very slow. Can I shoot you? Yeah, so it's not, it's not just uh, frame lag now, it's actually input lag. I get them all? Check back with the villager, maybe there's a reward. What if there isn't? What if I get back there and they're like, nah, no reward. Go back. Ooh, there's another ray gun down here that I almost missed. It blends in so well with the background. Oh! Oh my gosh. It's like I'm I'm trying to move underwater, you know? I see. Ooh, is there a secret up here? Is there a secret up here? It looks like there might be. I'm gonna go find it. Oh, there is! I found a thing! Open? Yay! Your TV signal has picked up some interference. 8A36B2. Switch codes on and off using the codes menu. Alright, we'll activate this one. Oh, no, 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 I don't like that. <laughs> well, that's cool, you can find uh, basically like little cheat codes for the game. I appreciate that. A little something extra in there, they don't have to do that. Alright, let's come back down. And we'll head back out go and collect potentially a reward no guarantees though oh there's another ray gun right there this is the same okay hello wow you're still alive i am indeed don't sound so surprised you can have a zappy thing i found the other day did you already give me a zappy thing it's in my house i've unlocked the door from here you're too kind okay zappy thing Let's go get a zappy thing. Apparently a zappier thing than the one I'm holding in my hand right now. What are, what are you? Aw. You woke me up. Oh, I apologize. I'm looking for a zappy thing. Uh, where's the zappy thing? Hold up or down these ladders. Got it. A little bit slow going up the ladder. Hey, where'd my ray gun go? You lost it climbing that ladder. Oh, dang. You need both hands to climb ladders. I don't have pockets or like a belt or something. Sheesh, ladders are stupid. I agree with my character here. Stupid ladders. I should find that zappy thing. Well, I was trying. I don't see any zappy thing. What, what's this? Is this a closet or something? Okay. Maybe it's here. Hello, little friend. No time to talk. What are you doing? Busy. You dancing? You dancing, little friend? I'm on guard duty. Aww. Oh, this is the other power cell thing. Don't mind me. I'm just gonna take the thing that you're guarding. Thanks so much. Can I jump down? No. I love guard duty. Aww. How come I can't do that? No one's getting through here. I'm trying to, like, drop down, but it doesn't seem like it will let me. Gotta go all... Gotta go the long way. I kinda wanna hang out and chat with this little friend. Got like a little tea bag hanging off its head. Adorable. <laughs> All right, back in we go. Um, should I go up? See, so go see what's out here. Wee. Slow movement. Here we go. Okay, this brings us right back up here. That's where I'll be. Huh? <laughs> Called it. We need to find the ship's command room. Huh? Ship. <laughs> yeah, that's what all this wreckage is. There was a battle and it broke up a bit. Oh, dang. Most of it is where we left it, though. Hmm. 
In the sea? Uh, no, in space, silly. <laughs> Spaceship. So we'll just pop into space then? Hmm, working on that. Interesting. Alright, let's get this zappy thing into the thing. Go get the other one. So I feel like I am walking through soup or something. Very, very slowly. Grab this one. Boom, got it. Head on over here. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, I hope they can manage to optimize this a bit here, because it's a bit rough. Go into space somehow and then find hub is my quest, seen at the bottom of the screen there. Oh, I'm gonna get hurt. Oh, I, oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, that killed me something fierce, didn't it? There we go, okay. Don't try to jump in between them, like that. Apparently this is a very foolish thing to do. Don't do it. Here we go. Got a gun. Got a health pack. Oh my god. Uh oh. Uh oh is right. Um. Can I just like. Oh, you got a weak spot, I bet. Is that like. There's a weak spot. Ah! Oh my goodness. This is actually quite difficult. Um. I can't hit the weak spot. Oh! I got it. Once more should do it. Oh, but I'm very low on life. Ah! No, no! <laughs> it's so tough because the movement is really, really slowed. Did I get one in? No, I didn't. How do I know once more should do it anyway? Oh my gosh! Ugh. Just keep picking up this gun every time I come in here. Nope, I'm dead. Shucks. Man. Uh oh, uh oh. It's not, uh. Yeah, I see that there's a weak spot there, friend. Whoa. Still hit. I think I could get up here. No, it doesn't look like it. This is. Oh, very slow. Oh, I got one. Okay, I got it once. And I've got almost full health. I can do this. I can do this. Oh, so close. Alright, come on. Come on, Ira. Focus. Woo! <laughs> oh, no! I am nearly dead. Man, those, those hits do a lot of damage. Alright, I guess I gotta wait until it's coming at me. Ugh. Oh. One more hit and I am done for. Again. Uh, uh. Nope. <laughs> I am not good at these types of games to begin with. Oh, so do you see how slow it is? Oh my goodness, folks. I don't know how, how well that comes across uh, visually. Okay, so the first one seems to be pretty easy, but then it like... I can't seem to get that second one. Oh, probably because I was holding up. There's that health pack there, but I feel like if I go for the health pack... Got it. Got it. Oh my gosh, it's so slow. <laughs> Yay, gems. Sure. Okay. Take a little breath here. Oh, let's move onward. Go a little bit further. Saw you up there. Little slimy jerks. Hey, it's another ray gun. I already have one. Yeah, but you should grab it for the extra ammo. Mm-hmm. I was about to. I really was. Okay. Uh, we need to bounce off of these bouncy boys, right? Whee! Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. I can see there's some kind of, like, minor precision platforming going on here. Uh, the problem with that being, you can't really control it very well. What was blocking me there? Um, oh! There's some stuff up there, but I can't seem to get it. Okay. And you can't, uh, aim without moving, either. 
so you can't kind of uh, aim upwards without moving forwards. That could used to be maybe tweaked a little bit. Although I suppose it's difficult to kind of design a system like that with this type of game. Okay. You can bounce up. How sad that shell is empty. Aww. Aww. I don't know. Looks like someone could live in it. Seems a waste. Okay. Weirdo. <laughs> Presumably you can get a slug in there and it'll become bouncy. Presumably. I should give peace a chance. <laughs> Alright, follow me then, you nasty slug beast. Come on, come on. Come have a home. Look at this. Giving homes to homeless slugs. What a kind, kind person I am. Kaboing. I did it. Uh-oh. No. <laughs> Another empty shell. Dang it. Am I gonna have to lead one of these, these little friends up here? I think so. Ooh, we're getting a lag again. Getting the legs! Oh my goodness. <laughs> um, wow. Alright, no, only one. Only one of you. The other one stays down there. Okay. We'll go a little bit further, folks. But I think until the game gets further optimized, I'm not gonna be able to get too far in it. Oh, am I gonna lose my gun now? Because I gotta go up a ladder. Yeah, I think so. Bye, gun. Thanks for shooting the, the little blobby friends for me. I lost my ray gun again. Stupid ladders. <laughs> yeah, someone should invent pockets. Yeah, or a bag or something. Yeah. Sheesh. It's an interesting mechanic. I've never had uh, anything like that before. Uh-oh. Don't look at me. You see nothing. I was not here. Woo! There we go. Stones? <laughs> okay, well, that's something. At least it lost its eye. It's not gonna fall on me anymore. It's just a mindless spiky thing now. Oh, or it was a mindless spiky thing. It looks like it gets its eyes back. Huh. Okay, see some more stones up here. I get the idea. Can I pick up more than one? No. Oops, I just threw that one. Okay. Can I only carry one stone? Uh oh! <laughs> I missed. <laughs> it's okay. We got this. Okay. So I got this one. I need to get past it. Oof. Okay. Climb. We climb. We're climbing. We're climbing. These stones sure are handy. Huh? Those aren't stones. They're not. Oh, that's snail poo. Oh, you're funny. Uh, what's up here? <laughs> Stupid watch. I don't know what's up there, but now I want to go look over here. Alright. Okay. There's another door thing. I wonder if that's my watch right there. <laughs> Slow motion jumping. Okay, so I need to find another zappy thingy. Seems to be. It's quiet. Too quiet? Too quiet. <laughs> quiet indeed. Okay, so there's my, my little door key there. Grab that. Uh-oh. I knew it. Can I just go? Oh my gosh. I'm dead. <laughs> oh boy. See, with the inconsistency of the, uh, the movements. Oh my god, I can't, uh, shoot this, this. Wow. It's the, the, the difficulty level really varies wildly here. Alright, let me get this one first. Can I just, can I just, can I just race through here? Ah! Oh no. <sighs> okay. Try again. Jump. Race on. Jump, 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 jump. Nope. I, 
I don't really see any feasible way to do this without just getting hit tons. Okay, well, I made it anyway. That was unpleasant. It was very unpleasant. I can hold the ray gun and climb vines, but not ladders. Hmm. All right, door. It's in here. What's this thing? It's a personal improvement station. I don't need improving. Hmm. Anyway, give it a try. <laughs> this one gives double jump. Ah, for a limited time. Aw. Double jump across big gaps. So I just have this for... 15 seconds? Did it! Can I just... Oh my god! It's become a bullet hell all of a sudden. Ugh, I don't even want to fight them. I just want to get out of here. Yeah, bullet hell when the movement speed varies wildly depending on, uh, oh my gosh. Depending on how fast it's deciding to... Oh, gross. Uh. Oh my gosh, I just want to... I also can't really see very well what I'm doing, to be honest. Hey! Shoot me. How do I, um... Can I just, like, jump on these? No. How do I get across there? Oh, that was a platform. See, this is what I'm talking about. I can't tell where the platforms are. And where, uh, is just decoration. Okay. I guess I got... Ah! I guess I just gotta run underneath here. Oh, but now I don't have... Yikes, I gotta go back. Ow, no, I can't go back. Ow! Ow! And I'm dead. <sighs> this game uh, is a lot harder than I expected it to be with the cute visual style here. Ow! Excuse me, I was standing on a safe platform, gosh dang it. Sheesh. That is not fair play. Alright, that is not... That is not how we behave. Ooh, slow motion. Slow motion. Goodness gracious. Alright, I'm gonna take a look at the next screen, folks. And then I think we're actually just about out of time already. Not heard from you for a while. What's up? I don't like the dark. Let me know when we're out. Very helpful. Um, I think I might actually call it here, folks. Uh, partly just because the uh, the input lag and the frame lag is really, really pretty bad. Uh, I can't remember the last time I experienced lag that bad. So I'm not sure what the game is doing that is causing my computer to run so incredibly slowly. I'm pretty sure I don't have anything else running at the moment besides OBS that would be causing that to happen. And I use OBS all the time to record games that are much more visually intense than this. So. It seems like they have some optimization work to do. Um, the difficulty level, maybe the, the kind of difficulty curve could use a little bit of tweaking. It is doable, as you saw. If I can do it, it's doable. I'm not super great at this stuff. Um, it has, it has uh, some things to work on, for sure. Um, but it does look like it's headed in a good direction. Again, the visual style is really nice. I like that a lot. I like the humor. And yeah, I, I will be checking back in with this one for sure. So uh, I guess that's all I have to say uh, about Grim Earth. Thanks so much for watching, folks. And uh, you know, if, if you didn't like this game, if it's not your cup of tea, just remember, uh, I'll always be back soon with another new indie game. And that one might just turn out to be your new favorite game. So thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.